Hey guys, King Cade here and welcome back to another video and in this video I'm going to be showing you all the fastest way to gain gems on Sisyphus Simulator. Let's get right into this. So if you all don't know already, there are currently gems in the game that you can spend to get relics and relics are in almost every world. All of these worlds right here besides the very first one, which you can go ahead and get relics by walking up to one of these people and then you can go ahead and get these. These increase your walk speed, how much wins you get, how much power you gain, how much luck you have, and also how much power you gain as well. So you pretty much need these if you want to be able to progress fast in the game. These are my current ones right here. But to get these relics, you have to go ahead and spend gems. Which to get gems there are currently a few different ways. You can get them from Super Rebirthing over here. You can go ahead and get them from buying them with Robux. You can get them from the shop over here. And you can also get them from the Season Pass. And I believe those are the only ways to get gems. Unless you want to go ahead and invite people right here, then you can also go ahead and get gems but the best way to get gems is by super rebirthing so over here if you go ahead and rebirth 35 times then you'll have the option to go ahead and super rebirth so you can click this it will reset all of your wins and all of your strength but we'll go ahead and give you one of these star tokens right here and it will also increase how much strength you get so every time you super rebirth it increases how much strength you get by two percent which is actually crazy good because you start off at i believe 15 percent and then you can get it really high up and i don't really think there's a limit but basically these little tokens right here that you get you can go ahead and spend them on super rebirth upgrades but then at the very bottom of these upgrades you have the option to spend them to go ahead and get gems which is actually insanely good so what i recommend doing to go ahead and get this is first get some pretty good pets so you can do this in like world one if you really want to but you won't be able to super rebirth a ton so what i recommend doing is get in a decently good world you don't even have to get in this world right here you could probably be in like the pyramid world right here but get in a pretty good world and get some pretty decent pets you definitely Definitely don't need pets that are this good but it does allow you to go faster so the better pets that you have the faster you're gonna be able to get gems which is awesome so then once you have some pretty decent pets what you need to do is go ahead and save up some wins and to be able to super rebirth you do need 35 rebirths and for the very first time i believe it cost a total of 35 billion wins which it does get more and more expensive every time and that's just because the price to go ahead and rebirth does increase but here we go let's go ahead and rebirth right here so as you see we keep everything we keep our worlds we keep our pets but our strength and wins do reset but what you want to do just be in your best world whenever you go ahead and rebirth and then just lift this like five times so there we go we lifted it like five times right there, which I just realized my pets aren't even equipped. So there we go. Let's equip those. And there we go. That's enough. And let's go ahead and push this. And even though we push it for like half a second, you'll see that we have tons of wins. So there we go. Let's push it again. So as you can see, we have like six billion wins. And what we're going to do is we're just going to spend all of them. So here we go. Let's spend all of them. And now whenever we go ahead and lift this, we'll gain a lot more strength. So see, we're gaining like 40 AA strength per click now. And now what we can do is I just need to push this a few times. So the price to rebirth does increase increase every single time which kind of stinks so every time you super rebirth you will have to pay a few more wins than the time before that but it's kind of in like small increments so it's not like a big jump but for me to be able to rebirth i think i need about like five trillion wins or somewhere around there but let me go ahead and unequip all of these and let me just equip some of these because these do make it faster so let's go ahead and push it again so i believe you can push it all the way to the end yeah so for you if you're just now super rebirthing for the very first time you'll only need like 30 billion wins and then after that maybe like 50 billion but me since i already super rebirth a ton i need just over a trillion wins i believe so there we go and we got to the end and now i believe we should have enough so let's just go ahead and spam this and there we go now let's go ahead and see if we can super rebirth and yes we can awesome so if you try to super rebirth right now you'll see that we do need 35 rebirths which is pretty easy and once again how fast you can do it depends on how good your pets are and what boosts you have and also what relics you have as well but once again whenever you super rebirth for the first time just get a little bit of strength not too much like five lifts push this and even though you can't push it very far at the beginning you'll get like three billion or so wins that you can just go ahead and use to rebirth just like this and as you can see we now have like five thousand percent so now we're getting tons of strength and this is gonna allow us to get wins even faster so let's go ahead and push this to the end and there we go we just got 800 billion wins and all we have to do is push it to the end one more time and then we'll already have enough to super rebirth again so there we go we pushed it to the end now we can go ahead and just spam this rebirth button right here and now we should have enough and there we go we just got our second super rebirth so every super rebirth that you do you will go ahead and get one of these tokens and to spend them just go ahead and click on the rebirth upgrades and then at the very bottom you can spend 
spend them on gems but don't spend them on gems just yet because what i recommend upgrading first is the winds boost and the power boost because these will make super rebreathing way faster such as this you get a plus 50 percent winds boost every single time you upgrade it so i upgraded it five times so i get 250 percent wind boost and a 250 percent power boost which is crazy good so make sure that you do upgrade these to the max before you actually go ahead and get this because these are going to make super rebirthing way faster then once you have both of these right here max then you can go ahead and choose what to upgrade but you can go ahead and just spend them on these so one of these stars equals five gems so we just go ahead and spam this right here and get tons of gems so there we go now we have tons of gems and now we can also just keep super rebirthing if we want to and if you're trying to get the best use out of your gems i don't recommend spending them right here because the best thing in this is actually this right here the thunder of zeus but to go ahead and roll this it costs two gems and you'll only have a 0.1% chance to go ahead and get this. But if you go ahead and teleport over to the temporal world over here, and if you walk over to the relics over here, you'll see that these relics only cost one gem, meaning that they're half the price, and you also have a 0.5% chance to get the Thunder of Zeus. Which if you go ahead and take a look at the Thunder of Zeus over here, you'll see that it does give you plus 300% power, while the one at the previous place only gives you plus 100% power, but you're 10 times more likely to get one at the previous place than you are over here because this one 0.1% chance for two of them and the other one is 0.5% chance so you're 10 times more likely to get one at the other place than you are over here and then you can just craft them together so it's just I have three of them right here so let's go ahead and unequip these ones and let's go ahead and merge them together so there we go let's toss them together merge and as you can see it now does plus 300% and I got all of these ones from the previous world because for every one of these that you get in this world you could get nine legendaries in the previous world and then craft them together and make three of these so the previous world is much better so i recommend spending your gems over there rather than this world right here but yeah that's the fastest way to get gems in sisyphus simulator though so that's gonna be all for this video so go ahead and leave a like subscribe and turn on post notifications and i'll see you all in the next video